Hey Cancer, welcome back to the channel. My name is Nali A.K. Awatero and I'm here to give you your weekly reading. We're going to tap into this energy, see what's going on with you this week. But before we get started guys, if you are new to the channel, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Click on that notification bell so you can be notified when I post a new reading. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you guys so much for all your love and support. I appreciate every single one of you guys. Alrighty, Cancer. As you all know, these readings are for Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. These are timeless general love readings. So they may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does. Leave the rest behind. Time is fluid, guys. So whenever you find this reading, you are meant to hear it. And there is no gender in tarot, guys. Please reverse the roles as need be. Cross watchers, you are always welcome. Guys, don't forget to check your other placements so you get a better understanding of this energy. And if you would like to book a personal reading, the info is in the description box below. Let's go ahead and get started. Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. Boom. You got me. Oh, my God. Somebody's trying to come back home with the Ten of Cups. There is some. There's a broken home here. Somebody's. Somebody has been enlightened. Somebody has gotten some clarity. Somebody wants a new opportunity. Somebody wants to come back home. Cancer. Oh my gosh, look it. As I say, somebody wants to come back home. You got the Six of Swords. I see this card because the boat is facing this way. To me, it's like they're returning. In other decks, the boat is facing that way. That's when they're leaving. But in this particular deck, somebody wants to come back home. Somebody has the sense of urgency to come back home. They have been cleared. They, not cleared, but they've had some type of enlightenment to want to come back home and clear something up with you let's see here this person is going to tell you that they have a lot of love for you this person is going to tell you that they don't want to miss an opportunity with you okay they have a new outlook in this connection they want a new direction in this connection this person knows that they've caused you this nine of swords energy where you've been been stuck in your head and just constantly thinking about these past situations with this person and this is their energy today as well they are going to tell you why they were being deceptive to you why they were lying why they were stealing why they were cheating okay and when i say stealing it doesn't mean that they're taking something monetarily from you they're just taking your energy your peace of mind okay and they're going to confess that what else here for cancer universe cancer you're going to get Cancer, sweetheart, you're about to get some apologies. After a while where you haven't been communicating with this person, the universe tapped into... As a matter of fact, you know what I just seen? I swear to God. You know how when a kid is acting up and you go behind them and you smack them in the back of their head? At least I've done that to my kids. Please don't report me. But I've done that to my kids. This is what the, the high priest did to your person. Went right behind them and what the, smacked them in the back of their head. And that's when this person figured out, like, what the hell am I doing? I am losing my cancer. What am I doing? This person knows that they caused you sadness. They know that they have broken your heart, that you've been depressed. But now this person is looking at things in a different way. They want to recover the situation. They want forgiveness. They want to return towards you. Okay? I just can't get that image of a kid getting hit in the back of their head. Oh my God, I'm not even going to lie to you. I think I did that to my kid like a week ago. I apologize, guys. This person has a lot of strength. Like, they're wanting to come towards you. Oh my God, there's a lot of happiness. You've manifested this. Didn't I tell you that this person was going to come in here and confess the fact that why they were being deceptive, stealing, cheating, lying? This is the energy. This person sees you as a wish fulfillment. Okay? They see you as your wish fulfillment. If you've been hoping and praying for this person to come back, guess what, sweetheart? They're coming back for reconciliation. They're going to come back and put the work and the connection with the Eight of Swords. This uh, With the Eight of Wands, I apologize. This person is going to communicate this to you. It's going to be like an erupt communication because it's going to be a tower moment. Like something you never expected. This person made a decision. You may be a little bit guarded when this person communicates, but they're going to tell you flat out straight to the point. I want to equal give and take here. I want to balance things out with you, Cancer. That is crazy. <laughs> I constantly keep, oh my God, I, I gotta go apologize to my baby. <laughs> but he was acting crazy though. He wasn't listening to me. Then I just had to go behind him. And I didn't hit him hard either. I went like, boop. In the other case, I, when I used to get hit, I'd be like, wow, I thought my head would be on the cross the street. It's crazy. <laughs> but no, the universe just came in and just gave them a smack. And they were like, what the, I, what am I doing to my cancer? This is your person's energy. They have gotten a real, real dose of realization here. Like, they've gotten some clarity. It's crazy. 
crazy. Look at this person wants to work things out with you. Okay. With the two of wands, you're kind of confused still because you're not sure if this person knows what they really want when they come and communicate this with you. But they know what they want. This person knows what they want. They want clarity. They want reconciliation. They want communication. This person is coming in to speak their truth, Cancer. Best believe they're going to speak their truth. Didn't I just say that they're going to speak their truth? Didn't I just say that they were going to speak their truth? Didn't I say that? Look at the moon. The moon card is when secrets and information is coming out to you. Didn't I say they're going to speak their truth? This person is going to offer apologies for their past mistakes. This is crazy. You are no longer an option, sweetheart. You will never be an option in this connection, okay? This person is going to come in and clearly tell you that you were never an option to begin with. They were just being idiots and they were confused. Look at the three of swords. This person is well aware that they broke your heart. They broke their empress heart. They know this. They know this. With the nine of wands in the reverse, this person wants to end this isolation period with you, okay? They want to come back towards you, and they want to communicate this with you. They're going to bring... Excuse me. If you are accustomed to getting some type of gift from this person, best believe they're going to come with flowers in hand. They're going to come something with uh, in their hand that you are accustomed to receiving. This person is bringing a token of appreciation to you. With the Eight of Swords, this person is tired. Is tired of being in this depressive mode. And they want to repair this connection with you. With the Chariot here, this person is moving towards you. They want to speak their truth. They want to tell you. They want to tell you the truth. This person wants to go to the altar and get married. This person has a lot of love for you. This person wants to plan a future with you. This person wants a balance, give and take in this connection, and they want reconciliation. They want to drop what no longer serves them. This person's energy when they come back towards you, they're going to be rather reckless because you never expected this communication. But they're coming in here to heal this connection. They don't want you to walk away from this connection with the Eight of Cups here. They want a happy home, a happy life. They want stability with you. They want to speak the truth. Damn, this connection is turning a point, is turning the corner like you've never believed. You actually thought that this connection was stuck. It's not stuck, Cancer. This connection is not stuck. It is moving forward. Now I got, this is crazy, guys. Now I got the King and the Queen of Swords. There's going to be a lot of truth and clarity happening here. Your person is going to take this leap of faith. Why? Because they miss you, because they love you, because they want to be with you, because they want this Ten of Cups stability with you. This is crazy, Cancer. This person will be speaking their truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth, baby. Let's get you some advice cards so we could close out your reading. <laughs> this person has fond memories. They think about you all the time. You're stuck in this person's head. You guys have been apart. It's time to move forward. It is time to move forward. Moving forward. Cycles ending beginnings. Okay? It's time to move forward in this connection. You guys are getting ready to open up a new chapter. And it's time for that. It is time for that. A budding romance. A new beginning. Look inward and cold shoulder. This is you, sweetheart. This is you. Totally you right here. Cold shoulder. You're giving this person the cold shoulder. That pushed this person into looking inwards and figure out where the fuck they messed up in this connection. With new beginnings, budding romance, moving forward. This person has a lot of fond memories about you. This person wants a new beginning. Overall, is going to want a new opportunity in this, in this connection. Coming apart, this was you guys in the past. And that's done. Endings. You got endings here. And then you have it here as well. With the moving forward. That is done. That is done. You guys are moving away from this coming apart energy. And you're moving forward into a stable commitment relationship with this person. Alright, Cancer. I hope this reading gives you some form of clarity. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Click that notification bell. And if you want to book a personal reading, guys, the info is in the description box below. You guys take care. Have a good one. Talk to you soon. Bye.